Yo, what's going on boys? Today I'm going to be playing this really good Expo Guards deck that I just made. If you enjoyed the video, please make sure to like and subscribe. And this deck counters like the whole meta. The only bad matchups that I can think of is RG and then probably Minor Poison. Probably though. Guards are kind of like scuffed in those matchups, so could be tough. But except for that, I feel like every other matchup is super easy. You're going to Fire the Pump and the Tower. I'm going to go for Archers in the back here to cycle. I'm like 7-0 right now, so I'll try to get 12-0. Yeah, just kind of arches in the back. This might be Golem, so he might try to go for like a Golem in the back or something. Just go for the Lumberjack in the back, though. I'm going to counter that with guards. I'm just going to guards on the side right here, and then I'll just go Mighty in the back for the Phoenix. Then I can pop my ability into it. Or actually, I can can in the middle, too. Got options right now, but I kind of want a Mighty. Okay, uh, I kind of have to cannon now because he played e barb So I'm going to cannon like this. Then I'll Mighty over here. Should be a pretty good ability on everything. Just gonna pop it right about now, and yeah, nice. Should kill the E-Barbs and Barbaro, even the Phoenix. Nice, that was a really good ability. I'm gonna Expert right now. He's gonna be able to afford a Golem, but he might have to play it opposite lane, though. I don't think he's gonna want to play it into the Mighty Manor, so... Just go for the Golem in the middle opposite lane. He's back to Lumberjack with that Golem, so he might go Lumberjack behind it, but... I do have Cannon back after I play the Ice Spirit, so... Should be fine, I can definitely Cannon on it if I have to. But I don't think he's going to Lumberjack. They might go for the Lumberjack on the Axe Bow, though, but not behind the Golem. Yeah, let's go for the Lumberjack. So I'm going to Guards. I'm going to defend the Axe Bow. Even though it's a 1 HP Axe Bow, might be able to get some damage right here. Like, two shots on the tower. Yeah, I'll take that. I'll take the damage. Just going to go for a Mighty Miner at the back when I'm at 10. Don't really have a second play. I'll Fireball to Pump if he goes for Pump. But if not, I'll just Mighty in the back. All right, well, I'll take that Fireball now, though. See what he does here. Michael Golem in the back. He's back to Golem with that pump, so definitely could go for the Golem. He's not really making a play, though. Kind of want to go in to bait out the Golem. Okay, does go for the E-Drag in the back. Super horrible E-Drag, because now he can't really Golem, and the E-Drag is also going to walk away. It's just going to die to my archers. I'm going to Mighty on the Axe Book here. Could Mighty on defense, but I don't really have to. I've got the archers kind of taking care of everything. I'm going to pop my ability here on the Phoenix. I mean, that's a dead Mighty anyways, but I wanted to pop my ability to keep my archers alive from the E-Drag and then also defend the right side and let the Axe die on the left side but also get damage on the Phoenix. I'm gonna Arches on this and he has no Elixir right now. Might have enough for like an E-Barbs now so he's probably gonna E-Barbs on the Axe but does go for the E-Barbs. I'm gonna Log right now to take out the E-Barbs. Okay, not bad. Um, He might Barb Barrel here so right here I'm gonna pop my ability to predict it then I'm gonna- oh my god that was not a prediction at all. But I was going to say, if I just pop my ability and go guards on the right, and I time it really well, I might be able to get some damage there. But I wasn't able to time the ability pop. So I'm going to Arches in the back here to cycle. Let's go for the pump. So I'm going to Expo in the middle. Alright, um, should not be able to afford a Golem. He might be able to afford it after the E-Barbs die though, but for now, um, should be some pretty good defense right here. Let's go for the Lumberjack in the middle. This guy's allergic to playing a Golem on my Expo. <laughs> Just not playing the golem. Okay. Um, just go for the E-Drag on the Axe I'm going to go for Archers. Then I'm going to Axe on the left here. Should only have like Lumberjack or E-Barbs or something. Yeah, I win the game now. Because he can't stop the Axe Bow. E-Drag out of Cycle. So I'll take the win. Super easy matchup. Like 100 of matchup for me. He couldn't do anything in that matchup. So I'll take the win. Going to put me at like 8-0 and I think. Pretty good though. Not bad. Just got to win 4 more. Alright, I'm in a game right now. I'm facing David. See what deck he's playing. I'm just going to go for an Ice Spirit to cycle. Kind of want a Mighty in the back. Okay, I'll just Mighty in the middle. I'll pop my ability to see if I can keep my Mighty Miner with only one damage on it. Like, only one Lumberjack hit on it. Okay, looks like that was not worth it. The Lumberjack would have gotten, like, four hits on it. But since I popped my ability, it got three hits. Still was not worth it, though. I'm going to Fireball the pump here, and then I'll see what he does here. Might have to nade at that back. Alright, perfect. He spent a lot of elixir there, so I can't golem anytime soon. I'm gonna go for the arches in the back once I'm at 10. Golem and like a lot of beatdown decks are super popular right now. What the hell was that? I didn't mean to do that, but it's okay. I'm gonna go for arches in the back here to cycle. Let's go for the golem in the back now that he is enough for it. I don't want to axe because then I might not be able to defend. This guy knows that I have a mighty miner, so he's definitely gonna e-drag with the golem. And if I don't like save enough elixir to defend the golem, I might be dead. Kind of want to guards on the right to bait out something, but he might just go bar barrel. Okay, back to Mighty Miner now. So I'm going to Mighty on the Golem here. Might go E-Drag. Yeah, let's go for the E-Drag. So I'm going to pop my ability here. Ability plus Fireball should take out the E-Drag. Oh, I did not hit the ability on the E-Drag. I'm going to log out the egg. I don't want it to respawn. Okay, do I have the archers that? Oh, I do. 
one HP E drag, but I'll just archers on it, and then the Mighty Miner should get some damage here. I'm gonna pop my ability actually. Wasn't gonna do a lot of damage anyways. I just wanted the ability bomb on the tower. So yeah, not bad. I'm down like 100 damage right now, but he might be able to pump again because I'm not back to a fireball. I'm gonna have to try and get back to it though, but uh, actually too late now. I don't want to fireball that pump because if I fireball, then the pump dies and then he just gets like a positive two trade or something and then he just goes golem in the back and I'm kind of stuck defending the whole game. So I'll see if I can like make something happen right here. Gonna ice spear on the e-barbs and then they should die. Okay, he might lumberjack on max, but no. Yeah, I'm gonna let that die. Don't really have anything I can defend that with, but even though that was an even trade, I kind of feel safer now because he can't really go golem lumberjack or golem e-barbs anytime soon. Gonna have to golem in the back to try and get back to the e-barbs or whatever, but might go e-drag with this. I'm gonna cannon. I'm gonna try to bait out the e-drag on the left here. I'm gonna expert right now. Okay, it should play like a phoenix or even an e-drag or something on this. If not, I just get a lot of damage. I'm gonna log right here, then I'll pop my ability on the double dragons and then i'll just go for a fireball on the e-drag and the phoenix okay it's good that it doesn't die right away because i'd have to log the egg out and i wasn't back to log but i'm gonna log it now then i'll go for guards up high he might nato everything though oh i think i'm okay i'm gonna cannon right here yeah that should be fine all right pretty good defense not bad and i activated king too i think he hit the king with that nato all right not too bad uh ebarb did get one shot on that left side tower though Kind of unfortunate, but he's definitely going to E-drag here, so I'm going to pop my ability, predicting it. Nice. Then I'll go Archers on the side. I'll go Ice Spear. I want to get to my Cannon right now, so I'm going to Cannon, like, super high right now. Uh, he might NATO, so I'm going to Fireball to take out the E-drag. All right, not too bad. I can definitely defend this with the guards. He might NATO, but I'll just go for, like, an Ice Spear at Log or something. Yeah, I'll be fine. going to Ice Spear. I actually might have to Archers on this. Yeah, I'll just go Log, and then I'll go Archers, because I don't want to eat all that damage right now, but... Not too bad, just need to get a Mighty Miner down and then I can Fireball the tower twice and take the win. So I'm gonna Mighty in the back. I'll take that Fireball Valley, even though I'm kind of like low on Elixir right now. I don't think he's gonna Golem because it won't make it on time. Might try to outspam me though. Yeah, let's go for the E-Barb. So I'm gonna Guards, I'm back to Fireball now. So I'll Fireball the tower and just kind of take the win. Once again, a super good matchup. I feel like all the beatdown decks can't really stand a chance. Mighty Miner is so good and the Fireball and Cannon on defense is also really good. So I'll take the win. That's gonna put me at 9-0. Hopefully I can get the clean 12 on though. That'd be nice, but I'll just hop right in. All right, I'm in a game right now. Facing I am God. See what deck he's playing. I'm just going to go for arches in the back here. Split arches in the back. Super safe. Can't really punish. Like, I kind of want to fireball on the right. Oh, I just got mighty on the side, though. I'll try to kill the zappies and then go expo with it. I don't know what deck he's playing yet, though, but this kind of looks like it would be RG or something. Yeah, so one of the worst matchups for the deck. I'm going to pop my ability on the zappies here. All right, not too bad. The Zappy is going to kind of kill the Mighty Miner and the Fisherman too, but I'm going to kill the RG with the Ice Spirit Guards. Yeah, that should full counter. If not, I'll log it back. Kind of logged it off to the side, but it doesn't matter. I didn't take any damage here. So I'm going to Axe on the left here. He might have Skelly King knowing that he has Zappies. Might also have like a Tombstone and then Mother Witch. Last card. He does have the Fireball, so it's kind of better than having a Lightning, but still. He can take out the Archers, so might be tough gonna expo right here and then i'll just see what he does oh giant skelly okay so that's definitely not gonna be easy to kill i'm gonna mighty right now and then he might go zappies i know that he's back to zappies by now so i'm gonna pop my ability and then yeah i'll just let the mighty go mighty might die like it might go to the zappies still yeah kind of unfortunate i was hoping to get damage there but good thing is we spent the same amount of elixir but he was kind of able to kill my push and get some damage on the tower too not too bad though in the future i know what he's um got in the deck so i think i'll be fine mighty in the back oh my goodness this guy's got mighty miner giant skelly and the rg i can't get lock in this this is like impossible can't get any damage i feel like i have to win this off of like fireball cycles but i'll try my best um just go for the log he might pop the ability on the archer yeah just go for the ability on the archer not bad gonna guards in the back here to cycle okay fisherman in the back part of me wants to kind of like mighty miner at the bridge let the fisherman hook it and then just pop the ability to get damage but nah that's not worth it because i kind of need my mighty miner on defense he's got the mother witch though so i think i'm kind of dead right now yeah kind of dead right now i'm gonna archers on the side and then i'll go mighty ice spirit on it don't have to cannon yeah, i'll just eat the one shot but that was super annoying though oh, i'll expo right here then i'll pop my ability on the giant skelly he's about to play on the expo nice Wait, I'll go fireball on the zappies. Might be able to make something happen here. Gonna guards. And then I'll log out the mother rich. 
Okay, wait, this is not good at all. Because the expo is going to lock on the pig and then it's going to lock on the mother reach, but too late now. The bomb kind of hit my expo, so yeah, this game's kind of over. Don't think I can get my damage back here, but I'll just go cannon on the anti fireball spot, then I'll go mighty in the back to activate my three card cycle. Might fireball that anyways, though, knowing that he can get away with it, but hopefully not. I'm gonna guards on here. Okay, this game's not gonna be easy at all. I'm gonna fireball though, just to get the damage right there. Then I'll go X on defense here, because he might go in. It's kind of a bad fireball on man. Well, not a bad fireball, I just kind of had to fireball to get damage. So it was like a questionable fireball. But just gonna log and then I'll go for guards cannon right here. Don't want an ice spirit. I don't think I need it. Okay, never mind. I definitely needed it. Yikes. Uh, that's gonna get two shots. Okay, only one shot. Almost got two shots, but I'm gonna log here. I'll go mighty. Oh my god, there's so much damage right there. I can't defend all this. Yeah, I feel like I couldn't have played that defense better. Probably could have with the ice spirit to prevent the one hit, but. I still would have taken like a lot of damage right there. Wait, I might be able to do something with the Axe Bug here. I'm going to Ice Spirit on the Fisher. Wait, he's only got a Mother Witch. Yeah, I'm going to Fireball it. Okay, he's going to have to Fireball. So if he Fireballs, I'm going to Mighty. Oh, just going to log. Okay. Yeah, that's super annoying. I got a lock, but it's like a 1k lock. Not going to do anything. My tower's so low. But I'm going to Mighty in the back here. Maybe I can like make something happen last second. Not looking too good though. Going to Arches in the back here. Cannon on the anti fireball spot right here, and then I'll go Ice Spirit in the back. Oh, I just fireball that side, so I'm gonna fireball on the tower just to kind of get the damage right now. He missed one of my archers too, and that's kind of good. Might Mother Witch on the side. Okay, I need that to die like right now. Oh my god, that was a pretty good log. I hate to admit it, but that log is gonna kind of save him here because I don't want to defend the left here, and the bomb might make it to my tower. Yeah, that's on my tower, I'm pretty sure. The fisherman kind of like pushed it too, but. I'm going to log right here, then I'll go Ice Spirit to not let the RG get any damage. And yeah, that was kind of close, but did not take any damage here. Going to Fireball. Mm, yeah, this game is over. Can't do anything. All right, kind of a tough matchup. Um, Wish I got an easier matchup or kind of wish that he didn't have like three mini tanks in the deck and the RG in there, but it's all good. It happens. I'll take the loss right here. To be fair, though, like he also kind of played well. He knew what he was doing with the deck here, so... I'll give him that, and then, yeah, that's going to put me at probably 9-1, and one, so I'm just going to hop right in, I'll see when I find a game. Alright, I'm in a game, facing Fiduska, I think is how you say it, not really too sure, but going to Ice Spirit to cycle, I'll go Mighty in the back to cycle too, see what matchup it is, um, I drag in the back, okay, so it might be Lava Hound, kind of a bad matchup too, because I only have one air card, but I can make it work, I beat Lava with like Cannon oftentimes, so might be able to make it work. Thing is, I don't have a queen in the deck though, so it might be tough. Just gonna pop my ability right now, and then I'll just go archers on defense here. Mighty Miner should get a lot of damage right now. Yeah, kind of a late bar barrel. He's playing Lumberloon, so I'm gonna go for Axe right now. Might not be able to Lumberloon on time. He's at like four elixir right now, so definitely not gonna be able to balloon on time. He's gonna balloon like now, probably. Yeah, just go for the balloon. I'm gonna Ice Spirit on it, and that should die to my one archer. I got super lucky that the one archer kind of like lived with one HP because I'd have to play a whole new set of archers on the balloon and then I'd probably have to defend the bowler with just an ice spirit or even a log or something. So not too bad. I'm just going to mighty in the back at 10 again. I actually don't have to. I, I kind of want to save my mighty so I can go expo mighty when he only has a bowler in hand. So I'm going to wait for him to make a play though. I know that he's up like two elixir right now. I drag in the back. Okay. Wait, this is perfect. I might be able to bait out like an E-Drag in the back and then just go Axe Mighty on the right. Come on, just play the E-Drag in the back. He's definitely going to E-Drag in the back. There's no way he won't. Okay, looks like he's got a Baby Dragon, but point is I predict the sequence, so Bowler should die and then I should get a lock. He's at 3 Elixir right now, though. Could NATO. He's at 4 now. I'm going to Ice Spirit on the Bar Barrel. Okay, wait. I'm going to predict 4 Elixir. He's probably going to freeze. I'm going to pop my ability now. Nice. Wait, I'm going to Guards and yeah, this game. No Bar Barrel in Cycle. Nice. All right, that was such a good read on his elixir. If I didn't knew his elixir, I would definitely not be able to make that play right there. But super glad that I was able to kind of make that play right there. Um, Yeah, I just win the game now. I'm just going to cut this game to the end. I'll see you guys when I find the game now. All right, this game's going to put me 11 and 1. So I'll just hop right in. Just got to win one more game to get to 12. I'll see you when I find the game. All right, on to my last game here. 11 and 1 at the moment. So I'll try my best. Going to go for an Ice Spirit to cycle. Then I can probably go Archers in the back. Okay, wait, never mind. I'm going to go for a can in the middle. Pretty good on defense there. Not going to take any damage. And then I'm probably going to have the archers in the back anyways, though. But just going to delay it a little. 
Okay, wait, never mind. I'm gonna play it on the flying machine. So this might be pigs, could also be lava. I don't know what deck he's playing yet though, but looks like a pretty annoying deck. I'm gonna mighty on the fire spirit. Don't wanna eat all that damage right now, so just gonna mighty manner. I'm gonna go down the lane. I might get some pretty nice damage on the right. I'll take that. He didn't defend it, so. This might once again be Golem. He has a Night Witch in the deck. I'm gonna pop my ability here. Okay, gonna Ice Spirit. Skelly Barrel. Oh, it's like Giant Skelly Clone type of stuff. Alright. Not too bad. I think I have match up here, but just might be tough and single to defend. I'm gonna Arches on the side. Okay, not too bad. And then I can probably go Expo and then try to go Mighty Manor on the Giant Skelly to get a lock. Could be wrong though, but I feel like that might work out. Furnace in the back again. Kind of makes me want to go in, but... No, I'll actually just defend here. I'm gonna go can in the middle. It's super easy to choke the game if you're facing a clone deck, especially in single elixir, so I'll just kind of play it safe. Okay, gonna mighty in front of my king here to kind of tank for the flying machine. Then I'll go ice spirit on it to not take any damage from that fire spirit, and then also gonna kind of like mitigate the damage from that flying machine. Probably gonna have to pop my ability on the night witch or something. Dark Ob, okay. I'm just gonna pop my ability here. I don't know if I timed it well, but no, nah, never mind. I didn't, so I'm gonna have to fireball that. I'll just fireball, then I'll log here. Kind of a bad clone, because he kind of fed into my fireball log, but I'll take that for sure though. Not too bad. All right, I'll just go for, I uh, think it's a good time to go Axe because I might be able to get it at the same time he goes for like a furnace in the back. Maybe? Nice, all right, not too bad. Um, He's not gonna be able to chime Skelly apparently, okay. So I guess he played it at like 9 elixir because he wasn't able to go for like a giant skelly on the expo. I'm going to cannon on defense right now. Flying machine should not shoot my cannon. It's going to go to my tower, so not bad. I'm going to go for a mighty in the back here to cycle. Then I'll go for... Uh, I don't know what to go for right now. I'm going to guards in the back. Pretty awkward cycle. Okay. Clone on that. Oh, he's got a poison. What? It's kind of weird. He has a poison in the deck, so it might not be giant skelly. That might actually be the last card. Now I think he has one more. Yeah, he has to have one more. I'm gonna go for the Fireball. Oh, it's Mega Knight, okay. That was pretty amazing Mega Knight because I don't have my um, Mighty Matter in Cycle, so I'm gonna have to go for the guards on top of the Mega Knight. I know it's gonna jump, but should take like three shots to kill the guards, so I think I'll be okay. All right, not bad. Then I can Expo right now to take out the tower. He can't defend this. I hope not anyways, but yeah, it's going to be pretty impossible for him to defend this. Yeah, that's game already because I don't think he can really stop the Axe Bow. I'm going to Fireball. Yeah, Fireball should kill the Night Witch and the Flying Machine. I would have hit the Dark Ob too if I played it one to the right, but I'll take the win. That is going to put me at 12 and 1. So if you enjoyed the video, please make sure to like and subscribe. And next video, I'm definitely going to upload Ladder. I'm at like 3,500 right now, but been kind of slacking on ladder so next video i'm probably gonna try to go for like top 20 or something season then so i'll try to get like a really good finish but uh see what i get lava hound everything's full max on this account so it doesn't matter but yeah next video i'll try to go for like 3600 and see you guys bye